So good evening everyone and welcome back over to one of these weekly updates that we're doing. And well as you see it is raining right now so I don't know how long I'm going to be out here because I thought the rain was going to stay lower for a little bit but it is starting to pick up a little bit. But you guys may be noticing I am carrying something in my hand right here. Nope, that's not for you buddy. I want you guys to meet someone. Someone brand new. I'm going to show you guys really quick. Just give me one second. He's running around like a little crazy little dog because it's raining now. Alright guys, I told you last week that me and Ali may be getting a puppy. Well, we did. I want everyone to meet Blakely. This is Blakely. This is our nine week old Corgi Australian cattle dog mix. Like I said, he was about nine weeks old right now. He is trying to get inside because it's raining now. But, well, this little guy, he's adorable. Um, so, we have had a little bit of troubles with him. We're still getting used to his routines. You can see he, yes, I know he's not wearing a harness right now. I'm trying to get him used to his harness, but he really needed to go to the bathroom because he just woke up from his nap. So, so but, so yeah, nine week old little guy. We'll actually end up doing it because the rain is picking up. We'll actually go back inside really quick because the rain is picking up and me and him both don't want to be out here. But I said, yeah, it did, like I said, it did pick up raining. It's been raining most of the day today, um, which is fine. We, we've needed some rain um, and it's also cooling it off quite drastically outside. So something that's been actually kind of nice is that we actually are getting kind of a nice little like cold front almost. Um, it's not where, I mean, this will we'll more likely in a couple days be back to our 80 plus degree weather, low 90s, but yeah. Like I said, we picked up him last Saturday. Um, we'd actually been in contact about getting him for some time. It's actually something we were talking about a while. Um, and he's, you know, yes, he is a puppy and we are, we do get kind of frustrated. That's why I didn't talk about him very much last week, even though like I filmed some things, talked about some things. I didn't really talk a lot about him, about us getting him and stuff. I told you there was a possibility and ended up getting him. And, you know, we do love him dearly. He is a little bit of a pain in the butt sometimes, but he is only nine weeks old. Um, and we have all this time to work with him because when, we, when this is all said and done, we start going kind of back to work and stuff. We're going to have to really make sure we're keeping up with him and stuff like that. But next week he ends up having to go over and he has to get his shots, um, his next round of like shots and vaccinations. So that'd be kind of interesting. Um, we don't know when we'll do that, but we'll need to do that before too long. Um, but yeah, you know, overall it's been, this week it's been kind of weird because all of a sudden there's a lot of talk about reopening procedures of like theme parks and stuff. And I'm not really going to talk a lot about the coronavirus and stuff, but I was just intrigued that like some states are starting to see themselves reopening. There's a lot of talk about like how is, about like there's like all these things with how are we going to reopen, how are the theme parks going to look when they reopen. And a lot of consensus is that when the theme parks do open, you're going to see a lot more virtual lines. You're going to see a lot more like you have to order, you have to order in store or you have to order online on your app you can't stand in a line um walkways are gonna be changed and i think it's just that big it's just it's it is what it is and you'll see a lot of that how that works out especially with shanghai because shanghai may be the first one to make that change and you'll see shanghai disney reopen and you'll kind of see how everyone else does it um but i do also to kind of address that people need to stop with the fake ads or the fake news articles because all these are there's a wall street journalist who says that disney won't reopen until 2021 and i'm like that's not true um because there's nothing been come from disney disney's on the reopening task force with florida um the president of walt disney world's on that on that reef that task force reopening process and stuff so but yeah it's just it's the thing about it is people need to stop reading too much into things um about this stuff um, and just let let us do let it do what it needs to do. Um, the, you know the cases are still rising. We are still seeing an influx of things. But like the thing that's weird is that in Florida you still don't see any recovered numbers. And I was reading an article that they're not reporting all the recovered numbers because a lot of the people who are recovering are recovering from home, so you don't know when exactly when they're recovered, and they don't want to give an estimate when it's not the truth. So I'm a little weirded out by that. But I mean besides that, it's. It's still just a lot of sitting around doing nothing right now. We're trying to keep ourselves entertained. But I do guys want to tell you guys that I am going to start trying, starting Monday, Monday through Fridays, I'm going to start trying to stream Twitch, like Twitch stream a little bit more. Um, I actually ordered a brand new, like, standalone mic um, for recording. Because all you know, I like to do my Planet Coaster videos, and you know, I love making those videos. Those are a lot of fun to make. Um, and I also want to start another series with a Jurassic World game 
um, because, I mean, why not? I mean, it's something to do. I know there's not a lot going on here. Like I said, I don't do any of the home vlogs anymore because the home vlogs, literally, I mean, with living in an apartment and 800 square feet, you really don't get as much, like, potential to do things. So, um, but that's definitely gonna happen. I'm gonna start trying to stream on Twitch Monday through Fridays. More likely like two to four in the afternoon. From that point, I will stream about two to three hours. Um, I may play some games on the console. Um, but I think most of it's going to be a lot of building, a lot of like Minecraft. I'm going to try to get with friends and see if we can do that. So if you guys are interested, if you go to Twitch TV, um, just look up the Walkers in Orlando. Same logo, same everything. Like I said, it's just a very simple, like it's a simple idea I've been thinking about doing for some time. Um, and I've actually have streamed a few times. Um, but like, I really want to get more involved with that because I want to connect to y'all a little bit more. I feel like connecting with y'all and there's this place that we can chat, we can talk about the theme parks, we can start doing other things with the theme, you know, start talking about more about the theme parks, maybe the opening procedures, you know, what's going on, how are you guys all handling this? Um, can I tell you right now, me and I are still like, we're, we're trying to make do. Having the puppy is a good deal because of having the puppy is a huge benefit for us because that we, I mean, he's, he is freaking adorable like he is absolutely adorable um but yeah so i bought a new mic um kind of a cheap mic so it may not be the best thing but i mean over the last couple weeks i've been like upgrading a little bit of my stuff i have a gaming a gaming um keyboard a gaming mouse to connect to the laptop like i said the laptop's not very good so maybe over time i may try to figure out can i try to sell something or try to do something where maybe i can maybe upgrade to a desktop but keep this laptop for um editing processes um, purely because I want to be able to make better content like that and also just it would be nice to have I'm not sure though because I'm not sure what's gonna happen once we go back to normal because there's no thing there's no normal after all this is said and done I mean everything will be there'll be some new things there'll be new new processes and stuff so but uh, yeah so if you guys are interested I'll leave the link down below about the twitch t the twitch channel um, like I said we'll probably do Monday through Fridays if I end up liking doing it I may try to stream every day for a little bit you know, if that's just chatting, if I don't have a good webcam right now, so most of it will probably end up being um, just chatting through the mic and stuff. Um, but I mean, I mean, tell me what you guys think. Should I play something else? Should I? No, oh, sorry, Blakely came running back in again. Um, you know, like I said, leave. You know, the link will be down below. Do you look? Oh God! Oh God! Hey, you see him? He's he's crazy. He did also just wake up, so he's like crazy. Um, still working on the potty, training with him, he's, he is beyond crazy, I'm trying to get his attention, see? But yeah, so, you got, I don't know how much you'll see of him as much, <laughs> um, but I wanted to tell you guys, we did get a puppy, you know, if you guys have any recommendations of what we should try to do with him, um, how should we work on his training, because we've been trying to work on his training, he's getting better with a lot of things, but he's still, he's still a puppy, so, but like I said, you know, the Twitch streaming, but... Yeah, like I said, I'll leave the description down below. Like I said, check it out. Cause like I said, I'm gonna try to do, put up a couple of those videos a week, um, maybe three videos a week of those, and then just other things. You know, we'll see doing the weekly updates of what's going on, and maybe I'll do some more of the you know top five top five like videos that I like to do, um, and just see if you know see if that's something we want to do. You know, talk about things like that and stuff like that. So, but I mean, with all that being said, as I do head out for the evening, cause I do have to take care of this little guy, cause he's getting really wound up for some reason. So with all that being said, as we do head out, I will see y'all next time.